the female. Um, I got the, the male into his new enclosure um, and it's all sorted, so we're all happy. Um, he's aggressive, but nothing compared to this one. Um, right, so I'm just doing this as a little uh, to show you what I've got to deal with here, but let's see what happens. Right. Right, let's get back. She is a cow bag. Right, if you get too close, she freaks out, and as soon as I film her, she calms right down, which is um, rubbish. But um, this isn't a normal tub, this is too small for her, obviously. But um, she's going into one a little bit bigger. Um, she normally thrashes about, and the, the cage is, while I was dealing with the other one, this cage was over there, and it, it moved. It was moving around, just like the cat off of Mouse Hunt in the box. Um, but she's really not too impressed. And again, this is weird. I filmed her the other day, and she was um, behaving fine. But as soon as I'm not recording her, she goes mental. Absolutely crazy. So, um... Let's see... Carefully. Right. And she's like that all the time. Thrashing and squirming about. Um, but she's very pretty though. But, um, but yeah, I've got to get some water in with her, so I've got to get her out. I can't put a water dish in there, because she'll just bang on me, do you know what I mean? So I've got to be a bit careful. But um, she's... Very... There we are, see? <laughs> she's not impressed. This is a bit more like what she's actually like, but um, I hope she'll tame down, but who knows, I mean, I've always thought bloods are a bit aggressive, but since I've had them, I've done a lot more research, and it turns out they're not, but these two are mental, so, you know, I just have to, you know, if there's anyone who thinks they can help me, please let me know, because I'm in need of this, definitely. Alright, thank you.